Good morning, you guys. It is day, day three. Is it only day three, Dad? <laughs> yeah, it's day three. Dang. Good morning, you guys. Look, we're here. We're here. We're here. Come look. It is mm, about 10.45 in the morning. And uh, there it is, Amber Cove. You guys watch our last vlogs, it'll look familiar to you. Pulling into port or backing into port was absolutely gorgeous. Look at the ship moving like this. It was like this all night long. Not too bad, but it was nice. You could feel the ship moving. You know you're on the water. There it is, Dominican Republic. So gorgeous. Maybe we'll see a carnival ship this time. Interesting thing. I forgot a lot of stuff on this cruise. This was such a busy week before we went on this cruise that, I mean, I forgot things I never forgot before ever. And hey, you can look at the pretty scenery while I talk. I forgot. I first started off with realizing I forgot my glasses. Not my sunglasses, thank goodness, but my prescription glasses. And I have contacts, so I've been having to, and I can't see without any of them. So I have to wear my contacts until I go to sleep, and then put them in first thing in the morning. And I don't get to rest my eyes, which is, I don't like, but it's only for a week. I forgot my mouse for my little laptop, so it's harder to drag all my photos from my um, SD card for my daily filming into my storage device. I forgot my, what else did I forget? Oh, my nightgown, my wonderful nightgown that I love putting on at the end of the night so very much. I forgot that too. I wore it in the hotel. And then I hung it on the knob and I forgot to take it off the knob in the bathroom and I have no nightgown anymore. So I haven't had a nightgown and I haven't been able to put my comfy pajamas on at night. And to top all that off, I forgot... This is terrible. I forgot a bag of my clothes. See, when I pack, I put my stuff in bags. And bags of, like shirts and bags of pants and bags of underwear and stuff like that. And I forgot a bag of shirts. So that means that I only have a total of five shirts to work with on the seven days. And one of them, two of them, I guess, are basically like the same color, like a mint I just, green. I just want to point out, guys, if we're talking about shirts, right? That I, I, I'm just wearing this shirt like basically three times because I wore it for a few minutes last night. I wore it basically so no one could see it in the car ride to here. And now it's the only day I'm really going to be wearing it. So if, if it looks weird, then that's why. <laughs> Period. <laughs> so you wear yours for a little bit, multiple days instead of all day long. Anyway, yes. I haven't gotten ready yet, which means putting on blush and mascara, and that's it. Anyway, so I'm going to have some same clothes, which I don't like, um, because I like fresh and clean. Look, the piloto. Piloto. I don't know how to say that. <laughs> well, as soon as I turn off the camera, I realize we weren't going to have breakfast, because breakfast ends at 11, and we were ready to go to breakfast at 11. Our plan was to get up at 10.30, go to breakfast at 11, have breakfast from 11 to 11.30 and then wait for some lunch. Zara is the one I want to breakfast. But it actually ended at 11 and lunch doesn't start at 11.30. So now we're just going to have lunch, which Zara sad about. There it is, Amber Cove. Ooh, I asked them about opening our divider the other day, remember? And she said they do it when we got into port. Because if not, it flops around. So that's going to be done. It's going to be nice. Uh, shut this to keep the hotness out. Oops, excuse me. <laughs> I don't know. That's a higher than one. It's pretty. Right? It's only one. It must be like communication. How gorgeous it is. Here's my plate. I got some of everything pretty much. Bolognese, spaghetti, some kind of lentil and potato bake, egg noodles, beef aged with rum, which is in the Cuban section, sweet potatoes, mackerel, pasta, crab cake some kind of cookie and fruit. Mm. And we didn't back in this time. Which is funny because I booked the room on the side that I did because I knew we would back in and we'd have a view of the port. But now we didn't back in, so now we have a view of the water. Which is actually cool because I think my dad would like that better. <laughs> did you hear how weird that was? Why? He just says that the Adonia will set sail at Friday at 12 p.m. Make sure to be back on board then. Today's Tuesday. That's weird, <laughs> isn't it? Be back. Be back in three days, okay? Oh, Have fun. Some people stay at those little huts there. They could. That no, no, I don't think you can sleep at the huts, but you can. I mean, you could always rent a hotel if you wanted, but 
Yeah, you're supposed to have a passport if you stay overnight though, but anyway. Oh well. It's quite gusty out there today. I'm British. Oh, I like this view better. Yeah, I was going to say it's much oh my better gosh, yes. it's not people polluted. Yes, it's a beautiful, beautiful view. Oh, so pretty. So it's different than I thought because I planned on facing the port, but I'm glad we're facing this way. I beat you. I ran into those stairs so fast. Whew. I wiped my brow. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, you wish. I don't think I've been down here to see this. There you go. Oh! Uh, honey, do you see the, do you see the arrows? Oh. <laughs> don't want your hat to blow away. <laughs> there she is, Dad. And here we are, you guys. Here's our buses, That's you guys. Yeah, can we get the bus? How much will we get to eat? What? We eat all we can. <laughs> see? Oh, that you find there. <laughs> Which bus? That bus? Uh, seven or six. Oh, I didn't get a number. Oh, the six. Okay, thank you. We didn't get a number. Oops. <laughs> We're getting on the bus early because we want our back seats. I had a dream about it. <laughs> so, I'm going to squish sideways for these seats. And we're going to get the back and leg room for me. Here, Dad, you let me sit in the middle. I need leg room. These are the good seats, I like these. Look at the leg room and everything. Oh, I was ready for some fun and adventure. Dad, are you ready for fun and adventure? Look at both things. Dad, are you ready for fun and adventure? Huh? You ready for fun and adventure? Yeah. And interesting experiences? <laughs> oh, yeah, man. I'm ready to oh. chocolate my banana. You don't get it like you eat chocolate. Oh, you you get try it with your finger. Yeah. You I bought a water. They're only a dollar here. No, there's well, a Well, actually, bottle. let me tell you guys I'm something. Not six dollars on the Norwegian sky. With you? No. I'm like, where is the it? The water bottle I've seen was like this size, but like two, two times. Okay, size. here you guys go. When you come to the port, I couldn't have the camera on too much because it's really windy and all you hear is <laughs> but you can see on our other Fathom videos. But um, in the playlist, yeah, yeah. when you come to the gift shop, sure. they have waters and a cooler and they are two fifty yeah, there. 250. You leave the gift shop and those other pharmacias and stores and the coffee store and all those are one dollar. This little pharmacia was on the Pro right, tip. right before you went around the corner to go to the buses. The mini they even had flavored waters, one dollar. Is it a dollar fifty at the gift shop they make you walk through? Two fifty at the gift shop no, you walk I think through. The, I think the flavored waters, I think the flavored waters were two dollars. Okay. I'm pretty sure. But the plain water at the gift shop was two fifty. The plain water outside the gift shop was one dollar. Was uh, they don't get uno to dolores. No, what's a dollar? Yeah, that's okay. Pesos? And, and not, that's not, doesn't mean dollars yeah, I know, in whatever. Spanish, but oh, well. it's still. We're, we're going gonna to start learning Spanish. Did you hear that? It's a 45 minute ride. Oh. And he's our dear driver, Giovanni. Hola! Hola! <laughs> English is not my first language, so if you can understand me at any point, just let me know. I will be more than happy to try to explain you until you can understand me. If you can understand me in English, I will say it in Spanish. This is a bumpiest ride. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm like, I should have brought my seasick tablets. This is going to be so cool. So what did she say? She said you're going to sort beans and then uh, what, bake them? Is that part of it? And then you box chocolates and stuff. Mix the chocolate and then box it. Yeah. And so. like there's four steps. You're going to do that the whole time you're there. And there's a gift shop where they sell it if you want. And she said you can try some of the stuff and try chocolate wine. I want to try that. It's really cool. I'm really excited. I know. I wanted to do it last time too. And I signed up for it, but I'm glad that we are here right now. I'm so happy. This is such a fun adventure. Isn't it? It is. <laughs> this is so neat. Those are all the cocoa trees. They, they said they all plant them in their backyard around this area so they can sell them to the co-op. Isn't that neat? Yeah. Helps give them some extra income. So it's called Altamira. I mean, High View. And there you go, High View. Gorgeous. Wow, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Yes. Wow. It seemed like a 40-minute ride, maybe because it's so interesting. I'm very excited. It smells like chocolate. <laughs> it really does. It does. <laughs> there, um, for that. Look there. For your head. Oh, you look good. Do I look good? <laughs> Why is my ponytail up? Yeah. Uh, 
Thank you. It's hot chocolate, Dad. Hot chocolate. To taste it. You gotta taste it. Thank you. So there's with or without milk. It's like I'm eating raisin bread. Oh, I saw that. At one of the houses next door, I saw a big uh, mat spread out with like bean things on it drying. I guess that's what it was. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it tastes like it has spices in it, doesn't it? it? Smells good in here, doesn't it? Come on in a little, Dad, so they can get in. It adds extra. <laughs> and the white table and the gloves. <laughs> Scary. Come in here and in her zone. Thank you. Yeah. Now we are gonna be working with 70 percent of chocolate. Mm -hmm. Please, we've got her. She's our teacher now. You guys watching how to do it? So I just completing the whole. Just completing. Just spread it down. Getting all the bubbles out. There's a lot of bubbles in there, wasn't there? That's why they get some chocolate, like the cheaper brand, because like bubbles. Yeah. It's ready. And after that goes to our refrigerator. Around 20 or 25 minutes. Are you ready, Zara? Yes. Okay. Look at you, Zar. You're licking the gloves. Don't your nose. <laughs> what have you been doing? <laughs> go, Dad. Go, Dad. Go, Dad. Go, Dad. Go, Dad. Go, Dad. Oh, you taste it? Yeah. Hand sanitizer. Yeah, my Snoop. Peggy, can you take what we made home? If you bite it. Oh, I want one of these. I don't know. Like a chocolate covered granola bar or something? I don't know. Oh, there's the label right here, Dad. This is really cool. I can't wait to go to the gift shop. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I said you just bend it. Bend it in the back. You figured it out. <laughs> That's fun. So I asked her, and um, they are chocolate, and the reason it says cereal, and it has, it has some corn in it. Like when we were trying the hot chocolate, it had like a texture, and they said they, you put it in the hot water, hot milk, and it melts, and they have it a lot of times for breakfast, but that's it right there. Isn't it cool? Me and Dad did all those. Not all those, but all those. <laughs> Fun, wasn't it? It was so fast too. We did a bunch. We had like two big old batches full. This is so fun. Ooh, look. Okay. You got four trays done? Four whole entire trays. Oh, that's, that's good. It looks like chocolate covered pickles. Really? Yeah, and chocolate covered bananas. <laughs> What's this going to be? We are going to be cleaning the beans. Oh, cool. Out. The bad beans and put it in a bucket that would Oh neat. Yeah. So if they're cracked or what? Two together, small, two small, two together like this. Okay. They're cracked. Too small. So they're too small, they're stuck together or they're yeah. cracked. Mm -hmm. This is our bad this is the bad plate. Oh I don't know. I have to ask. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Not that many bad ones. There's a bad one. My name is Mi nombre es. Mi nombre es. Darius. Darius. What is that? 
Soy B. Soy B. Florida. Florida. Yeah. Uh, one thing that's why to do. Uh, three times. Oh, sorry. Oh, wow. <laughs> How do you say I like? Video juego. Hmm? Video juego. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Me llamo James. Está en Florida. Okay. What else? Me gusta. Me gusta. Like. What do you like? See. What, like? what do I like? Me gusta. Me gusta. EB. Me gusta most everything. <laughs> <laughs> he likes to have fun. <laughs> Disney World. Disney World. <laughs> Mickey Mouse. Mickey Mouse. <laughs> oh my God. Mi nombre es? Yeah. Uh, Manara. Manara. Excuse me? Manara. 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 Me gusta. Me gusta drawing. Uh, drawing? Boys. Drawing. Uh, uh, muchachos. Drive? Artist. Art. <laughs> ah, okay, okay, yeah. okay. Uh, so, dibujar. Huh? Dibujar. Not say that. You didn't know. <laughs> <laughs> Me gusta dibujar. Me gusta dibujar. Pintar, to paint. It's like a paint. Yeah. Yes. yeah. Pintar, dibujar. Uh, mm -hmm. You have fun, huh? Mm -hmm. You're on a roll. Yeah. <laughs> So this looks like we're doing something with the beans that we had just stored outside. What do you guys think so far? Huh? What do you think? I think it's really fun. Yeah, it's like the papel one, but way more way interactive, productive, interesting. Oh yeah. Taste one. Because you could taste a little one. So you can taste the nibs. Oh, a new tray. This, you can taste one of these? Yeah. Just like this little okay. piece. Oh yeah. There. Oh, I can see. Taste it, Dad. You taste it? Does it taste like chocolate? <laughs> yeah. What do you expect? Mm. The beans were dry by the sun. That's so good. It's like a roasted that? chocolate. It's like really good. I think I'd rather eat bean than the actual finished product. Yeah, because the finished product so like <laughs> Did you taste the piece, Sarah? Yeah, yeah, so it's too rich. Did you taste the piece? Oh yeah, I will. It's delicious. It's like roasted, crunchy chocolate. Like this chocolate itself is way too rich. Oh man, so, like, yeah, because there's no sugar boxes. in it. Yeah, it makes more Yeah, crunchy. that's good. So we're picking this stuff out like the husks. Oh, and I guess this is the nibs that we leave. It doesn't taste like chocolate. Yeah, it does. It's like roasted chocolate. This is so cool. So neat. Uh oh, there's a whole bee. I wonder how they crush these and clean them and all that stuff. So are you got chocolate on your arm? Look at his chocolate on his arm. Right there on the back. There's chocolate everywhere. <laughs> we're gonna smell like chocolate. I bet we're gonna smell good. Look at that big bucket of nips. That's awesome. Isn't it? What? Gift shops this way? No. No, that way. This is a gift shop, you guys. Yeah, I'll try. Chocolate? <laughs> oh. Menor likes this here. I like it. And it's potty. <laughs> it's super cute. It represents the smile that Coco brings to us. It reminds us that it's our duty to give the same smile back to the farmers. That's so, so cute. So cute, I love it. Men are sad because they're just decorations. Yeah, just one. Okay. You gonna let me try one of the little candies? Look, here's those things we bagged up. Look. Hot chocolate mix. This time we didn't forget our cash like we did when we went to Capel. Yeah. <laughs> we got a bag of chocolate. It was, watch out, $15. We got like five things. Nibs and all kinds of stuff. I got you some milk chocolate. Yeah, I'd want to say. Uh huh, watch out. There's um, cocoa bean pods on the tree over there. Oh, cocoa bean pods on the trees. Oh, I see them. Yeah. That's cool. Hmm, I haven't tried the chocolate yet. Is it still it's soft? Here, open this, honey. We'll try this. Here, Dad, there's your piece. Does it taste like Hershey's? I doubt it. Well, you like it? It has cocoa nibs in it. That's not, this isn't 70. This is normal with cocoa nibs. Huh? 
See, what's what's the hard thing? They like coconut. Shell. I said they're cocoa nibs. The nibs that we were just doing in there. You know the nibs that you tasted? I'm gonna eat this. Tastes like a crunchy. You know the stuff we just did? Oh my god, that's so good. I want that. You could buy a whole box full. We should have got more. Mmm. <laughs> Um, you know the nibs we just sorted? They roast them and put them in this. Mm-hmm. So good. Oh, I'm kind of sad I just bought one. all those special ingredients in there, okay? She's going to check and see how much work we did right now and then tell us. And my dad's like, look, zombie crossing. That sign now is this sign. Yeah, turn the light up. Ready? That looks like zombie. So my dad says. So I edited, zombie. So I edited it. Zombie crossing. Okay, we'll show that to dad. That's hilarious. <laughs> Good editing job, Manara. Thank you. We cleaned 50 pounds of nibs. You know, Whoa. the second step, putting the shells out, that is a lot of work. We cleaned 50 and pounds we of nibs. 50 pounds of beans. That is separate from beans. 50 beans. pounds of beans. And we wrap 604 cocoons. Whoa. And we sell in the gift shop $197. Right? Oh, yay. Thank you for being here. Thank you for That's so cool. The development of the Dominican Public Michael.